Hello, uh, this is Manny again. Let me do a quick demo on uh, layering textures. So uh, that's one on top of the other. So uh, here's a sphere. Let me just assign a new material quickly, like a Lambert, make it uh, red. Uh, here we go. As such, and uh, there it is. I can move it on the side here if I want and start building on in my work area here. So let's just uh, find the actual shader that we need. It's a layer. Notice that there's two of them. Uh, make sure you, that you take layered texture. This one has a lot more options um, when you want to deal with textures instead of layer share, layered shader. So here we go. Let's just click on that once and notice that it uh, here's the layer editor. Um, it's pretty intuitive. Um, let's look at this. This actually uh, is my first uh, layer, so let me just assign something to that, uh, like a procedural, let's say, text uh, checker. Good. Uh, it builds the tree here as such, and there's my uh, layer manager again. So now I want to assign a new one. Let's left mouse click in here. There's the new one and I will assign, oops, select it, and assign let's say a bulge uh, there and just fix this up a bit. Okay, let's just set this like this, these two as such. Good, so that kind of makes sense. And uh, finally uh, you want to just uh, middle mouse click this to that and attach uh, and uh, select color. Good, so all we see is one of the uh, two and that's kind of normal. Let's go back to the layer editor here and see what's going on. So notice that the checkers on the left, this one is basically further away from the actual surface of the, uh, of the object. So you got the bulge and then you got the checker on top. So if I select the checker and just reduce the alpha here, notice that it will reveal the uh, bulge, right? Good. Uh, let's keep it halfway and there's many other blending modes uh, here to get the uh, look that you really want. That's about it.